Hello, welcome to Linda Likes Tarot. Hi, my name is Linda. If you're new, welcome. If you're returning, what's up? I'm glad that you're back. Okay, so today, this reading is going to be for a specific sign. We're going to find out together. Um, please be your own leader of discernment. Uh, when watching this general reading, not everything is going to resonate with you, and that is okay. Drop what doesn't for someone else to pick up to appreciate. Thank you for all the likes, the comments, the shares. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, it definitely does help out the channel. Okay. I heard rough, rough. I'm a dungeon dragon. <laughs> it's a song by Nicki Minaj. Someone here could be mad. You could be mad. This person could be mad. Someone's mad. Someone's pissed off, I think. This could be somebody here who's mad at your elevation, mad at your growth, mad at your healing, mad that you have changed in some way. Sag has been coming out first card for a lot. You guys could be dealing with a Sagittarius or someone who has Sag somewhere in their chart. Or someone lacks understanding. Or someone lacks understanding. I don't know, something like that, okay? I'm also getting like someone's afraid that they're going to be without or something here. I don't know. Someone, whoever I'm speaking to, you got success coming around the corner. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because you freed yourself from something with this 11th house. You're gaining some sort of freedom here. And this freedom is because... Um, or you're gaining this freedom because you believe in yourself. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what zodiac sign is this for? You guys can be seeing a lot of crows. I'm hearing a lot of crows. Cr crowing. <laughs> okay. We have Gemini. Did we do Gemini yet? Let's find out. It, oh, look. It's 515. Okay. It's 515. I think If you guys have been feeling like spacey in the head or you if you guys have been dropping things or like plates and cups have been falling or something or slipping out of your hand there's someone here who's doing like voodoo or hoodoo or witchcraft on you okay um I also feel like someone here is about to get 5150 for um, playing in a lot of magic, all right? Someone here could be losing their sanity. But let's get into the, um, this is, whoever this person is, they refuse to change or they don't like change or they don't like that you have changed. It's gonna, it's gonna bring some sort of tower moment. Some sort of tower moment's coming in. Someone's going to be coming in, like, um, yelling at you, acting crazy, y'all, acting unstable. Somebody wants to fight you, okay? Yeah, I haven't done Gemini. So, Gemini, this is your reading, okay? You can have Gemini anywhere in your chart, sun, moon, rising, Venus, north node, south node. Flay, I was going to say, flay it where it needs to go. Flay it. Someone here could be, um, eating fish or... Someone here um, could be cooking fish or you could be craving fish. I don't know. We got uh, Virgo. 
Someone here could be uh, a Virgo or have Virgo somewhere in their chart. Something about Jack mackerel patties. Hot sauce. We have Pisces. Someone here could be a Pisces or have Pisces somewhere in their chart. Mm -mm. We have Aries. Someone here could be an Aries. You could be dealing with an Aries or you can have Aries somewhere in, your, somewhere in your chart. There's someone here that wants to challenge you, child. We have Aquarius. Someone here could be an Aquarius or they could have Aquarius somewhere in their chart. <laughs> we have Taurus. Okay. You could be you could be dealing with a Taurus or you could have Taurus somewhere in your chart or a Gemini. And then we have Capricorn. You guys could be dealing with a Capricorn or you could have Capricorn somewhere in your chart. Right now you're being intuitively guided to trust the the psychic knowledge that you have when it comes to your resources <clears throat> or what it when it comes to like what you should and shouldn't do with your resources right or if you are deciding on what to invest in and what not to invest in use your intuition do something in a practical way or just spend money on the things that you need to spend money on not like don't spend in excess I don't know who this is for um Oh, there's somebody here that feels like you don't you don't know how to manage your finances or something this person don't i don't know who cares i don't know what this is about but you got a bunch of motherfuckers all up in your energy someone here is going to come in with some some form of communication though this person could be in trouble because or you're gonna get some sort of communication about someone being in trouble maybe about someone being locked up or somebody did something illegal i don't know or somebody betrayed you you're gonna find out someone's gonna give you information about it someone here could be scared about telling you maybe they're afraid you're gonna be raw raw like a dungeon dragon <laughs> holy spirit holy angels what's going on here locked up Oh, or someone's having a hard time communicating with you. Someone's throat chakra could be blocked. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what's going on with my gemmies? What do they need to hear if it's time for their highest good? Yeah, you're about to get some sort of victory and success here soon. All right, count your blessings. I also feel like this victory and success is coming in because you are in a you have an attitude of gratitude. All right, we have I am thankful for this life and the opportunities that it presents. Amen. Excuse me, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Somebody's family here is under judgment. That's for some of you, not all y'all. Or someone here wanted to attack your family spiritually. We have um, partnerships and alliances, number three. There's somebody here that definitely wants to come in and collaborate with you. Somebody here could be 63 years old or 36. Someone here could be born in March or in June. Someone here could be born um, on the third of the month or the sixth of the month. Or someone here could be a life path three or a life path six. Okay, we have rest and rejuvenate. Some of you are being asked to rest and rejuvenate, rejuvenate at this time. Something here about um, self-development or you resting and rejuvenating is essential for your growth at this time. Someone here could be 43 or 34 years old. 34 keeps showing up. The number seven could be very significant for somebody. We have emotional loss at the bottom of the deck, number five. Someone here is not happy with some sort of change here. Or someone's about to lose something. Maybe this is what the change is and they're sad about it. Ooh, denial wanted to pop out. Somebody here was in denial of something. This is why they're going to lose something. Okay. It says, I acknowledge my fear, but I replace it with the insight of awareness. Someone here didn't want to come to the reality of something. To the point to where it was too late. Like if someone would have came to terms to something or accepted something, things would have... They, they would have had a, a more positive outcome or things wouldn't end up as um, as drastic as they were or I don't know I don't know where I'm going child but yeah whoever this person is that's um, feeling some sort of emotional loss this is someone here who was deceptive towards you or backstabbed you betrayed you in some way or this was somebody here who was envious of you 
Or is somebody here that misses you? Maybe this is someone who lost you. Maybe you walked away from this person. This person misses you, but they're envious of you because you're getting some sort of fulfillment of wishes, like something about your life is going well and they're upset. This could be someone who wanted to have power and control over you. Or someone's upset because you took back your power and you're in control of your own life. Someone here could be born in 1994, 1997, 1995. Someone here could be 49 years old. Don't have to be. Um, or 47. Peace is being granted to you. This is something you've been patiently waiting for. Okay? It's coming towards you. It says, I am a being of love and I release all negative energy. Maybe this person, you deemed them as someone that was negative to you. And your environment, your aura, your your everything. And so you let them go. You picked up on their deceptive and envious ways. Okay? This could have been someone who also gave you like dirty looks or some shit. Um, you picked up on it and you're like, no thanks, deuces. Right? And now somebody all sad about it. <sighs> somebody need therapy. Someone's area code could be 634. Holy Angels, what's going on? What do they need to hear at this time? Someone thought they were the goat. This could be a very cold person. This is someone who's very domineering. They thought they were, they were the goat. Or maybe this is someone who worships goats or worships Dival, Dival, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what's going on? We got nobility. You're getting some sort of high honor here. Whoever I'm speaking to, you're getting some sort of high honor here. You're being celebrated in some way. You're achieving something, and it's like. Whoever I'm speaking to, you're worthy of this. You're deserving of this. Maybe there's someone here that doesn't, didn't feel like you were. I'm also getting like someone doesn't like that you're being seen as someone with high honor. This could be a wolf in sheep's clothing that doesn't want you to feel this way. I'm also getting there's someone here that, that doesn't like that you're being seen as a leader of a pack. This could be somebody's mother or father. I'm also getting this could be somebody that wants to always see you as like a baby deer. Someone who always needs them or something. Or someone wanted you to always need them. Someone here could have put somebody in a jar. I'm telling you. Someone's doing some sort of hexing, cursing, magic, whatever this is, black magic. They try to put you in a jar. They try to trap your soul. So that you wouldn't ascend, you wouldn't grow, you would always be stunted in some way, so you could always need them. If this is somebody's parent, like, you're not the only child they, they try to do this with, or something, I don't know. It's coming to an end, though, whatever this is. Also, the divine is stepping in, okay? Divine intervention number 34 something about your discipline okay there was someone here that was trying to stop your discipline your dependability your reliability someone's name could be bella practicing gratitude and this is why you're getting some sort of victory and success this is also why you're being divinely protected also your obedience you do 
do something with grace. You do something with class as well as what I'm getting. I'm also getting there's somebody here that wants you or wanted you to be seen as someone who's like um, addicted to self-pity or something. Like someone wanted you to look like somebody who's always like crying over some dumb shit or... But this is what this person does. Like, someone here always complains or something. They complain about their life. They're not... They take things for granted. This is someone here who's always playing a baby violin. Okay? It, there's something wrong with someone's attitude. Somebody got an attitude. They have a negative attitude. And, and it shows because it shows in what is going on with their life as well. be going through a partnership that's ending I'm also getting it this person had like allegiance to some sort of dark entities or spirits here um, they're no longer partnering up with this person anymore they're they're going against this person I'm also getting something about sex magic could have been involved in something here. Or someone here was trying to harvest your energy by doing sex magic. Somebody wanted to do this or has been trying to do this in order to stir up some inner troubles within you so that you can get off course. Somebody wanted to bring personal challenges to you Okay, but whoever I'm speaking to, whenever somebody tried to do this or send this type of energy to you, it you since you have an attitude of gratitude and you're somebody here who has discipline, it just caused you to want to improve yourself more or or overcome the challenge instead of allowing the challenge to overcome you. Some shit like that. Tell me more. What do we have? Um, and rejuvenate. You guys could be hearing a lot of music that reminds you of this person or something here. Yeah, someone here could be viewing you as a rebel. Okay. You guys could be seeing the angel number 33 a lot. You guys are being divinely guided. You have mastered something here. So it's time for you to rest. You've already you you've mastered something here. So it's like there's no need for you to fucking worry. It's time for you to chill. I'm also getting whoever I'm speaking to, like someone, there's an energy vampire out here who feels like you're a rebel or wants to view you as someone who's um, negative or evil because you are standing up to them or you're, you, you block them out your energy. They mad. They're also mad because you're in this peaceful energy as well like someone someone doesn't i keep getting this energy of like someone does not benefit when you're in a state of peace and tranquility like this person benefits when you are in a chaotic situation like it's easier for someone to get into your energy or to take from you when you're ungrounded I also feel like someone keeps trying to send you, like, this primal energy for you to, like, sleep with people. Like, re uh, like reckless sex or something. Lust energy. I don't know. Something like that. Or someone here wanted people to look at you like you were a, a lusty, busty whore. Or, I don't know. This could be, like, someone wanted other people to view you view you this way like you, they wanted your peers to view you this way this could have been someone who was trying to um have a, com a whole community view you that way i'm also getting like someone here was trying to pressure you to be something you're not someone wanted to put you under pressure somebody wanted to break you we have the death will come whoever i'm speaking to you're immortal you just keep rejuvenating yourself you just keep overcoming shit you just keep transforming transformers <laughs> more than meets the eye okay 
and then someone else here is not immortal they're mortal so someone here uh, they they made they took a risk and this is someone here that don't have nine lives this is someone here who has one and they skating on thin ice some shit like that or somebody's mind is fragile or someone's fertility is fragile i'm also getting like there's something here about someone's ovulation cycle i don't know Someone didn't expect you to make a comeback or someone didn't expect you to um, overcome something here that they put you through or I don't know. I also feel like you need to stay grateful because the divine protected you from some shit you didn't even realize you were going through. I feel like for some of you, not all y'all. Um, oh, come on. Hey, come on. Oh, shit. Okay, fuck it. I'll use these. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what's going on? What do they need to hear? Yeah, someone didn't expect your ass to bounce back and be fucking victorious. <laughs> Somebody did some sort of magic on you. They didn't think you were going to come back from. Someone was trying to um, really, really get you off base. Okay? Something about your perseverance. Yeah, someone here could have been putting you on the bat burner. The bat, the I can't even talk. The back burner. All right. Something about someone's stove could be of significance. Maybe one of your, um, what's it called? Your burners don't light up or something. There's someone here who's definitely seeing your potential. That's why they wanted to stop or hinder you in some way, okay? Someone was um, intimidated by your potential. Tell me more what's going on. Listen, this could be your own damn parent. This could be your own damn mama or daddy. We got throwing shade. It says criticizing, disrespect, judgmental. So you got a judgmental son of a bee that wants to come back and act like they want to work together with you. They want to partner up with you. Be careful of this individual. Because this person just be talking major shit about you. This person wanted you to be broken. This person wanted to, be, wanted to bring destruction to your life. I also feel like this is someone here that is um, beyond repair when it comes to like their own heart chakra. Like this is someone here who, um, this is someone who's really dark. Or this is someone who, this is someone here who has that you're dealing with that has never fully healed or recovered from some sort of heartbreak so it's like anytime they see someone else um on their way to achieving something positive in their life they want to destroy it like this is this is this is hurt people hurt people vibe i'm also getting like someone knows that they shattered your heart in some way maybe they want to do it again tell me more what did that rest of you yeah, you bossing up, child. You bossing up. Somebody's so mad about this. Somebody's so mad that you bossed up. That you self-empowered yourself. You're independent living. Okay, you're leading the pack. What was I saying? Somebody doesn't like that you're a fucking leader. You're being asked to, to chill. <laughs> okay? Um, there's I, I don't know why I feel like you could be worried about something. You don't need to be worried. You're right in, you're right, you're in alignment, okay? We have I-M-Y, I don't know, it says yearning. Someone's name could be Amy. Um, but it says yearning, it says missing someone, reminiscing. So someone here could be thinking about you heavily. You could be thinking about this person too, but that's probably because they have you on their mind. Um, we have last straw, okay? So... Someone here feels very overwhelmed without you, okay? This person can no longer deny how they feel. This is someone here that knows that they can no longer keep some sort of secret from you. Um, somebody's coming to some sort of breaking point or someone knows that they can no longer hold you back in some way. This, also, this is also making them sad. 
something about sexual stuff. Someone, someone, somebody, I don't know. I don't know how this fits in here, um, but it fits somewhere, child. <laughs> someone here could be fantasizing about you, whoever this person is. Um, yeah, this is someone here who is very un unreliable. I'm also getting like, if you had to cut someone off because you knew that they were being uh, a hater, right? Um, this person feels like you, you abandoned them, like you did them wrong in some way. But I feel like whoever I'm speaking to, you were intuitively guided to, to, to cut this person off and it was for your betterment. This person could have been someone who just wanted to come in and, um, like, play with your heart. They just wanted to have sexual intercourse with you. Um, or you need to be careful because someone here that you cut off that want, who's reminiscing about you, they want to come in and they want to they wanna give you something. Something that you can't take back. This person might want to infect you in some way. Because uh, maybe this person don't like seeing you bossed up. They want to put that to rest yeah someone whoever i'm speaking to you leveling up child congratulations you have fucking graduated bitch you learned a lesson you learned a lesson gemini congratulations keep it up okay you have completed a cycle here you're about to have a blessing let's see let's see let's see what else what else what else I'm also getting somebody here could be sad because they have an STD, child. And you don't? I don't know. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what's going on for my Geminis? What do they need to hear? What am I Geminis need to hear? I really hope you guys can hear me because I'm not, I'm not like, um, hooked up to the mic. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what do they need to hear? What am I Geminis need to hear regarding the situation? Yeah, we have dirty work. It says they're having evil deities do the work for them. So yeah, someone here could be sending you like monitoring, hovering, familiar spirits. Um, or someone here could just be sending like the spirit of like gluttony, the spirit of sexual stuff, lust, the spirit of whatever. Somebody wants you to, somebody wants you to dabble in something that is not of your highest good. So you could be slowed down or tied down or so you won't be seen as a leader in some way. Okay, yeah, you're being asked and guided to do a cleanse at this time. It says clear your aura. Okay, tell me more, spirit. We have an unwanted watcher for sure. For sure, we have guard up. Yeah, it says put up your boundaries. It says if you're going to keep them around. So if you have someone around you that you know is weird, and you have to like keep them around, maybe you live with them or um, you work with them, whatever it is. Maintain your boundaries, please. We have fear tactics. Yeah, so somebody here wants to make you scared. We have trying to intimidate you. Somebody wants to make you scared. Okay. We have cleanse. I'm also getting somebody here could be intimidated by you. This is why they want to make you feel intimidated. We have cleanse. It says go take a spiritual bath or shower to wash off their energy. It says water is cleansing. So this is what you're being guided to do at this time. We have doppelganger. It says they dress or act like you because they want to be you. So somebody here wants to be you. Very strange. Um, okay, we got 1212. It says you are about to be showered with prosperity, baby. And then we have 888. It says wealth, abundance, and opportunities are on their way. So that's what you can expect. And something about red flags. Something about red flags has been happening all day. So pay attention to the red flags when it comes to this individual trying to come back into your energy. This person... Um, or this person that wants to come in and um, reunite with you and work together with you. Someone has some sort of hidden agenda here. I do feel like their their emotions of missing you is genuine, but I feel like it's like a self-serving. It's self-serving. <clears throat> Someone here gets Someone here can speak Spanish because I keep hearing this one bad bunny song. Somebody's mad about someone's mad that you're doing well. 
What the hell is going on? What do they need to hear? Yeah, there's someone here that's going to come to your aid. You're being asked to be patient. Or this person has to be strategic and patient to come towards you because maybe they have someone else like watching them, okay? There's something here about someone being puzzled by your confidence um, or you need to remain confident about having the ability to resolve some sort of problem that you could be dealing with, all right? Or you're about to get the missing pieces of the puzzle here. Maybe somebody didn't want you to know some sort of information, but it's coming in. Um, this is going to bring some sort of new, bring in some sort of new transi transitional phase into your life. You're also being asked to let go. Okay. Let go. I could be talking to a divine feminine. You could be someone who's very, who naturally has like sexual magnetism and this like really fucking irritate somebody else and they want other people to make to make you look like you're a, like I said like a like a like a, a whore <laughs> okay someone here to be 23 years old someone here to be born on the 15th of a month holy spirit holy angels what's going on what do they need to hear at this time yeah whoever I'm speaking to you're a rising motherfucking phoenix somebody thought they destroyed your ass they thought they burnt you to a crisp but then they turned around when the smoke cleared, your ass rose up like a goddamn goddess, bitch. Or, or a mythical creature, I don't know. But we have um, courageous. You could be a feminine energy. You're definitely going through some sort of rebirth here. All right. You could be definitely going through some sort of change. Or this is the change that you needed. Maybe somebody here was a catalyst to this change, this growth for you. Like, this was something that was good for you. Um, but obviously, it, it it came with a side of pain. <laughs> a lot of pain. We got freedom, though. You're free here, okay? Somebody wants to heal a situation with you. This could be um, family, lover, friend, business that wants to heal something with you because you've changed. Or now that you've changed and you're in a better place, like... I don't know, somebody Somebody feels like they can't, somebody now knows they can't defeat you, so they're like, let me just, I want to just, I still want to be in this person's life somehow. I don't know, you guys could be seeing 1010 a lot. <clears throat> or somebody wants you to help them get enlightened or be empowered like you are, I don't know. Someone here could be 46 years old, this could be you or somebody else, flip it where I need to go, child. Spiritual angels, can you tell me more? Okay, we have revolving door. It says coming and going quickly. It says goal oriented. Okay, it says moving in the right direction. Yeah, you're moving in the right direction. You're doing exactly what you need to do. <clears throat> yeah, you're on your, you're on the, you're on the precipice. I can't even talk. You're on the brink of a new beginning. Okay, you're about to get some good karma. Something about your imagination. Your imagination or your mind or what you can vision. You can be a visionary. Whatever it is, it's like whatever you put your mind to, you you can accomplish. And someone else is realizing this too, okay? They could be admiring you for that. Someone here might want to put you in the wrong direction or change you in the wrong direction. We got the toilet here, Joe. Somebody here could have IBS. Or somebody is having stomach, stomach issues. Or someone here could be throwing up in the toilet or something here. Maybe this is because of your success it's like i don't know if somebody knows that this is impending doom for them your success is their fall their demise you're about to get some sort of luck and pro or prosperity here or you need to release some sort of negative energy okay some some of you could be constipated with <laughs> with um old energy that needs to be released okay you need to flush it down the toilet i'm also getting like you need to be private about what your next moves are, okay, when it comes to, like, business matters or when it comes to your healing process or just when it comes to your day-to-day -day goals or activities, okay? Um, keep them private because you got somebody here that wants to be at war with you or they want to they wanna bring chaos and conflict to your goals or 
your luck and your prosperity okay someone doesn't somebody here is definitely competing with you this could be a masculine energy you don't have to be or someone here is just in masculine energy we have pisces here okay somebody here could be a pisces someone here could be a libra okay or you're about to get justice here that i could be speaking to a natural healer that's about to get some sort of justice here all right or you're about to get justice for your selflessness for your generosity I don't know or for listening to your intuition okay you're someone who's very kind very intelligent you're well balanced okay you could be someone who's very fair very sociable okay you'd be very beautiful friendly open-minded someone here this is another reason why people or this person wants to work together with you they know they lost something good basically but it's a little too late I think someone somebody's sad because maybe in the past someone didn't think that you were being your true authentic self but they now now that they lost you they realize that you were being true maybe you were like emotionally open with this person maybe someone wasn't used to that maybe they thought you were lying to them or pulling pulling their ink in their chain i don't know <clears throat> Yeah, you could be someone who has a strong sense of identity. Maybe somebody here was trying to get break you to the point where you wouldn't, you wouldn't, your sense of identity would be shattered. You know how like when people put certain people into trauma and then they start, they develop like um, severe mental um, illness where they decompartmentize. I can't even say the word. They decompart. I don't know. They put things in different compartments of their mind. Okay, in order to. Um, be well i don't know something like that or they they their personality becomes shattered or somebody wanted your your uh your energy to be fragmented in some way somebody wanted someone to have a mental illness but i feel like someone else is going to be getting that shit um i'm also getting like someone doesn't like that you have courage you have the courage to change something here Something about the number 55 could be significant. Someone here could be 55 years old. You're going to be getting peace here when it comes to this new beginning. This new beginning is entailing peace. It's something that is owed to you, something that you've been patiently waiting for, something that you've been patiently striving for. You've been putting in the work for this. Someone is seeing you as someone who's very um, wise. I'm also getting there someone here that's looking at you and they feel like they want to settle down with you or they want to settle down with somebody like you this <laughs> oh lord have mercy someone here could be from canada Gemini need to hear spirit. Well, let me do this. Yeah, someone definitely was competing with you. Or someone had other people competing with you or comparing. I don't know. Child, someone was doing a lot of feel like and now they feel dumb. Someone someone was doing a lot and now they feel dumb. Okay. Holy Spirit, holy angels, what's going on? Someone, someone's tracking somebody. Someone's trying to find you. Someone's, or someone's trying to do this to somebody else that you know. Um, or someone's trying to figure out where you live or what you do on the day to day. So just be private. Be private. Okay. We have police station and we have GPS. And someone here be somebody here getting bad news. Somebody here might be getting caught up for stalking you. Somebody here might be getting arrested for stalking you. Um, I'm also getting that like somebody here could have paid a private investigator to to follow you. That's another thing that I'm getting. Um, and whatever their, this private investigator is telling them, they're receiving bad news. Like, whatever they were hoping for, they're not getting it. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, maybe someone was hoping for you to have a loss or have a fall. Or someone was hoping that someone would, um, get you to do some sort of reckless, reckless sex or with somebody. <clears throat> Ew. Somebody wanted you to have an STD, child. Or do something reckless. Listen, somebody could be trying to follow someone so that they could take advantage of them sexually. Someone here might want to come in with the energy of force 
and try to force someone to engage in sexual activity with them. Be careful, please. Be careful of your surroundings. Somebody is weird. We have um, pregnancy here. Some of you might want to do this to keep you, to get you pregnant so they can tie you down. Because you could be in this boss bitch energy and somebody doesn't, or boss dude, flip where it needs to go. And somebody wants to, like, limit you in some way. Somebody wants you to be tied to them. And somehow, I don't like it. Someone here is fed up. Or you could be fed up with this person. Or someone's trying to find ways or ideas on how to get towards you. I don't know. Maybe you're keeping... You're keeping yourself private. Someone wants to come in with some sort of love message here. Someone here could be under pressure. Someone knows they're running out of time. They know they're, something's going to be found out. Under pressure. There could be a, a corrupt police officer here that feels under pressure, though. Because they agreed to follow you. Something was unlawful. Whatever this was. Something, something, someone broke the law somewhere. Yeah, so, there could have been a police officer or a private investigator that decided to take some money on the side. This is getting me like paid under the table to do, to, to follow you or something. Maybe this is someone who needed cash. I'm also getting there was someone here telling if authorities, like police officers or whatever, that you were out here having doing a side hustle by having reckless sex with people. Somebody here could have been throwing, like dragging your name in the mud, child, getting getting police officers involved and shit. This is because someone someone didn't want you to be happily single, or someone someone wanted you to I don't know. They wanted to throw a monkey wrench into your life. Someone didn't like how stress-free your life was, so they wanted to create conflict and drama. This could have been up to four bitches that were doing this. Four feminine energies. This is someone here that's upset because you said goodbye, okay? Or there's a feminine energy that did this to you because you, maybe you got them pregnant and you walked away. I don't know. <laughs> Who knows? Or someone got you pregnant and, you, and they thought that was going to keep you with them and you said deuces. I don't know, chow. Or someone's leaving a pregnant partner. Or someone lied about being pregnant. So that another person... Well, we keep getting that storyline. Tell me more. Yeah, something... This could be something about the twin flame situation that has... Okay, so your twin flame... This is for some of you. Your twin flame has a sex addiction. They're missing you. They feel fed up with this sex addiction. They want to end it. Okay. They, they, they want to get on this twin flame journey with you. They're thinking about a lot of romantic feelings for you. I'm over it. Maybe somebody got a, a got a, um, maybe someone got a prostitute, uh, pregnant or something. Maybe they got in trouble for picking up with the street walkers. I don't know. I don't know who you're dealing with. I don't know what this is. Um, <laughs> the fuck let's get out big bertha and see what we got going on holy spirit holy angels listen big bertha is not um it's not for everybody please take big bertha with a grain of salt okay not everyone's living wild ass lives we have black magic made me sick so somebody was playing with some something they weren't supposed to and they got sick maybe they were trying to get you to get sick maybe someone wanted you being hovered over a toilet barfing or taking <laughs> or having diarrhea we have uh, ancestors are proud of you okay so your ancestors are very much proud of you okay holy spirit holy angels they're also proud of you because you blocked somebody's energy off from you you listened you were obedient okay they're proud of you they're glad that you listen some yeah, we got stolen money. Somebody here could have stole some sort of money from you. That's why they were trying to get you to be sick. Someone's upset because you believe in yourself, okay? Or you need to continue to believe in yourself. Believe what you're intuitively being guided to do. We have 1144. You guys could be seeing this angel number a lot. I just heard, I wear my sunglasses at night so I can, so I can something, ding, 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 ding. <laughs> I don't 
don't know. Uh, someone here is up to something. Someone's in the hood doing something not good. What the? Yeah, someone wants. Someone's doing something they ain't supposed to. What in the hell is going on? Yeah, there's gonna be an unexpected change. Something might be happening at night that's unexpected. Ciao. Oh well, I guess I'll keep it here. Um. Something's gonna change. I feel like somebody thought something was gonna go one way and then it abruptly changed. I feel like this is God stepping in, okay? Someone here could have falsely accused you of something, okay? They could have been, a lot of people could have been gossiping about you. Something about the month of March is significant. Someone here could be a Pisces or an Aries that was involved in this situation that falsely accused you of something, okay? <clears throat> could have gathered a bunch of people. We have the word no, okay? You could have told somebody no, and then they said, you know what, I'm going to do black magic on you. I'm going to make you sick. This is someone who was envious of you because you put boundaries up. I'm so tired of people. <laughs> I'm so tired. I'm tired of people. Tell me more, Spirit. Tell me more. We got Samson. Regina Spector says, song is about someone dying of cancer. So someone here could be losing their hair. This is somebody here that doesn't take life. Um... This is someone here who doesn't appreciate or is grateful for life, okay? This is someone here who stole something from you. We have birthday, something about your birthday. Birthday sex. <laughs> Maybe somebody wants birthday sex with you. I don't know. Tell me more, Spirit. What the hell is going on? Someone's name could be Sam. We have the feds already know. So the fed rallies already know something here about someone. Let's look up this angel number real quick because it's like... Remember it. Oh, I forgot to I forgot to do this. Okay, so the angel number 515 means change. It says seeing the angel number 515 may indicate that a significant change or transformation is about to occur in your life. It is a reminder to embrace these changes with an open mind and a willingness to adapt. This number encourages you to step into your personal power and take the lead in shaping your own destiny. Well, God damn. That's exactly what you're doing, child. I hope you're doing it. Or you need to, okay? Somebody mad about it, raw, raw, like a dungeon dragon. Tell me more, spirit. Okay, so what am I? Why am I saying that? <laughs> it's like such an automatic. Okay, look. So the uh, uh, the angel number is eleven forty four that I'm looking at right now. It says it's a new beginning. So eleven forty four, this number, it represents a new beginning. Okay. You need to know that the divine, you need to know that divine is on your side, okay? There's some sort of opportunity that's coming your way as well. There's also something about like you being, okay. So if you're seeing the angel number 1144, yes, it's, it's letting you know that you are in divine alignment and things are going to be happening in your favor, but you also need to change something up that's gonna help some sort of process go smoother. So someone needs to release some sort of something, okay? Or you got someone attached to you that needs to fucking go, okay? Or someone needs to take some sort of much needed action here. But the feds know about somebody's actions or what they've done. I'm not gonna do that yet, let's see. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you tell me more? We have guilt. Someone here could feel guilty because they try to falsely accuse you of something or make other people believe something about you. Somebody here could have planted something on you in order for you to look guilty or to um, set you up in some way to frame you. We have brother's friend. Somebody's brother's friend could be upset and did black magic on you. Okay, or they're saying no to this plan. They don't want to do it. Maybe somebody knows that they're going to lose some sort of case here or something here is, um, it's not going to pan out. 
Like someone here no longer wants to agree to something here. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you tell me more? We got Cancer Leo Cusp. There could be a Cancer Leo Cusp here that could be falling ill. Okay? Don't have to be flipping ways to go. What do they need to hear, Spirit? We have, wow, the fuckery is real. So, yeah, whoever I'm speaking to, you're about to find some, find out some real, you're going to find the missing pieces, child. It is, you won't be like, the, this is some real fucked up shit. Whatever these motherfuckers were trying to do. Also, I feel like this is what the feds are, <laughs> this is what the feds are thinking. Someone's first middle or last name could start with a W. There could be someone here who wears, like, um, a suit or someone has somebody here who has like a position of authority that sees what has been done to you or what has been happening to you and whatever this thing is they know it's unfair they know it's some sort of injustice and they want to do something about it so you could have someone here who's trying to protect you okay holy spirit holy angels can you tell me more we have five 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 this came out again expect the unexpected something here is definitely going to be changing Someone's first middle or last name could start with an S. This could be you or someone else. We have boss, lead, or manager. Okay, you could have a boss, lead, or manager that was involved in trying to steal money from you or resources in some way. I hope this isn't too loud. We have not to be trusted. There's someone here that's not to be trusted. Damn. Tell me more. We have, you're getting a promotion. You're getting a promotion. It's like someone here feels somebody here feels guilty. Someone here feels guilty because they try to falsely accuse you of something, and it's like, like it's no matter what this person did, you still win. Ew. Something about this could be significant. <laughs> That's for some of you, not all y'all. Um, tell me more. We have drugs. Alcohol, abuse could be of significance here when it comes to a, a boss or a manager or someone or if you're a boss or a manager, someone here could have been um accusing you of using. Okay. I also feel like there's a boss or a manager that had some sort of jerug addiction or alcohol um addiction that that's why they agreed to doing stealing from you in some way. They needed their fix. I don't know. We got uh telekinesis. You guys could be experiencing like an increase in your spiritual or intuitive abilities. That's for some of you, not all y'all. We have testify. Somebody here is going to be called to testify something or someone lied under oath and they're getting in trouble. We have colorism. Somebody here could be upset about you because of the color of your skin. Okay. The shade of your skin even this could be your own people don't have to be though we have love offer somebody here wants to come in and give you a love offer someone else is very upset about this <clears throat> holy spirit holy angels can you tell me more what else is going on we have stepdad something about your stepdad maybe your stepdad is um addicted to some sort of jerugs or alcohol maybe your stepdad was involved in trying to steal your money Maybe your stepdad could be involved with a, a, a group. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you tell me more? We have the second coming. Something about Jesus. Something about divine, the divine stepping in. We have sister. Something here could be happening with your sister. Maybe somebody, you're going to find out your sister um, falsely accused you of something or lied on you in court. Or you're going to have to testify against your sister. Maybe your sister's going to be found guilty for something. Um, maybe your sister was trying to steal something from you. Or you're this sister. Okay? Someone could have falsely accused their sister of something. We have... Time is up. Okay? Some, time is up for these motherfuckers. They did what they did. It's like the divine was watching to see how far somebody would go. Or how far these people would go. And now he's saying, like, this is enough. Y'all going to hell. <laughs> Every single one of y'all. Okay, we have child abuse. Somebody here was abusing you in some way, or maybe you were an abused child. Flip it where it needed to go. We have Capricorn Aquarius Cusp. Damn. Yeah, somebody's getting a felony. Someone's going to be charged with a felony. We have God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change. The courage to change the things that I, ha that I can 
and the wisdom to know the difference. We have let go and let God, okay? These people don't know what they're doing. I mean, some of them do, but how do we keep getting this why? You could be asking yourself why. Why would they do this to me? Okay. We have this too shall pass. This was this is for your growth. We have get a getaway driver. There could have been a, a gate could have been a getaway driver involved in this situation. We have yes, whoever you're thinking about, yeah, it was this motherfucker. Um, someone's first middle or last name could start with a K that's involved in this situation. There's some weird sexual in there's some weird sexual things going on in here, like somebody was using lube or i don't know we got grand theft auto somebody here could have stole your vehicle or tried to steal someone's vehicle we have um people are probably not happy with their lives if they're busy discussing yours so you got these motherfuckers talking a lot of shit about you they could feel guilty now um somebody here was trying to set you up okay maybe someone here was trying to set you up to look like you were an abuser or someone was trying to check uh set you up um in order for some black magic to make you sick or something. There's someone here who's definitely obsessed with you though. This could be a Cancer Leo cuss. This could be a boss leader manager. Um, this could be whoever the person that stole from you. This could be your stepdad. I don't know, this could be somebody. We got comfortable living in their lower self. So you got somebody here who's comfortable living in their, their lower self and they cannot be trusted, okay? This person is okay living in their south node. Whoever I'm speaking to, you're in your north node or you're ascending there you don't mix okay we have divine feminine is secretly wait divine feminine's friend is secretly in love with or divine that's a divine feminine damn divine masculine's friend is secretly in love with him so somebody's friend is secretly in love with them okay maybe that's something that's gonna be found out we have fake laugh okay so somebody here can have a fake laugh right we got 1244 you need to start viewing yourself in a higher light all right because these motherfuckers view you in a higher light that's why they were trying to bring you down we got power outage someone here is about to lose some sort of power or position of power here or somebody's lights are gonna go out okay someone's gonna have to someone's gonna be taking a long ass nap we have manifestation mode 369 okay you could be manifesting right now this is why you're getting a promotion we have sagittarius capricorn cusp this could be a boss this could have been a manager this could have been a brother's friend okay this could be the person who has a fake laugh or someone here who had who was um who's a colorist or someone didn't like you because of your shade of your color okay we have jail somebody going to jail and they're getting a felony okay Someone no longer wants to be distant from you. They want to get close to you. This could be a Pisces that wants to come in with some sort of love offer. They want to come in towards a feminine energy. Okay. This person could have the Chinese zodiac sign of a tiger. Gemini. We got Taurus out here. We got goat. We have snake at the bottom of the deck. So someone here could have the Chinese zodiac sign of a snake. Someone here could have the Chinese zodiac sign of a goat. Somebody here could be a Taurus. Someone here could be a Gemini or someone here could be a Taurus Gemini cusp. Someone here could be, um, have the Chinese zodiac sign of a tiger, note the date. I could be talking to a feminine energy or this is a feminine energy that wants to come towards you. We have Pisces. Someone here could be a Pisces or they could have Pisces somewhere in their chart. Or there's somebody here who has a secret lover that is about to be exposed. Um, maybe the secret lover that this person has, they pay them. This could be a sugar mama or sugar baby, sugar daddy, whatever. Whatever it is. Someone's getting paid for, for sexual intercourse, I feel like. Or some sort of exchange or... <laughs> this, is, this is messy. This is very messy. <clears throat> this is messy. <laughs> uh, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what are my Geminis doing here at this time? What am I Gemini's in here at this time, Spirit? We have steady work. It says light to aid in maintaining employment. Someone here is trying to make sure you get... Somebody here... Something about your boss or your manager, child. I don't know. Somebody does not want you to make money. If you quit a job or something, it, your, your ex-boss or manager, okay, could be salty. Like, they don't want you to... 
this could be like a narcissistic boss that's like, well, if you don't work for me, you work for no one. <laughs> this person's a psycho. Tell me more. We have avoid doing dark arts at this time. Okay, don't do it. Tell me more, spirit. There's nothing for you to worry about. Okay, so there's no need to do something here. Yeah, we have domination. Somebody here could have been trying to light candles in order to dominate you in some way. Okay, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what else they need to hear? We have Saint Martha. Someone's name could be Martha. Mm. We have domination, taming difficult people or situations. Someone here feels like you're a rebel. Someone feels like you're a difficult person because you stood up for yourself and you see through someone's bullshit. You see that someone's a fucking snake. They're a fake ass whore. <laughs> We have smudge or smoke your body with cleansing herbs, okay? Because someone here wants to keep you stagnant. We have stagnant energy. It says move things around, clean and organize. This is what you're being asked to do if you're in this stagnant energy, okay? Child, please. Someone doesn't like that you bossing up. They're trying to slow your ass down, baby girl, baby boy. That's a lot. Someone wants to offer a higher level of commitment someone wants to come in and com um, communicate with you clearly someone here wants to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with you this could be somebody in your family or somebody that you share a family with or this is someone here that um the 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 third party was their family that didn't want y'all to be together we got past life relationship maybe you and this person share a past life with each other okay there's something here about forgiving and learning that's involved in this situation in order for a relationship to heal yeah we gotta give your relationship a chance i don't know that's for somebody here um Have leave behind old solutions so however you were going about something it's time to find a new way of doing something something about thinking outside the box something child you guys could be dealing with a Sagittarius or someone who has Saggy somewhere in their chart or you do or you guys could be dealing with a Pisces Pisces is out here heavy Something about philosophy and something about religion or something here about philosophy of beliefs or differencing of beliefs or someone's deciding to go a different route on how to approach you because however they've been doing it before, it ain't working, okay? Sate's taken. <laughs> no. Sate's. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what's going on with my Gemmies? What do they need to hear? What do my Geminis need to hear? Third eye is awakening. Somebody's third eye here is awakening. Okay, this could be you or somebody else. We have natural Reiki powers. So some of you could, um, something about the power of your hands, okay? Could be of significance. Tell me more. What else do they need to hear? Or your hands are very healing. We have success. You got success coming your way. If you guys were thinking about going into um, Reiki or taking a, a course or something here, I feel like you should. Tell me more what's going on. We have remain calm at this time because somebody here wants you to get all raw, raw like a dungeon dragon. Tell me more. We have divine protection, Brrah. divine protection and intervention is here for you god is not going to let anything bad happen to you okay tell me more we have god's ambassador yeah because you're god's ambassador you could be from atlantis or something swimming with the fishes what else do my genuine here Something about a house. Some of you might be, um, if you are waiting for an offer on a house, you stay hopeful. 
you might be getting a letter in the mail letting you know that you're you you what's it called you got the house or uh, somebody something about real estate or a property you're gonna get it or something was left to you you're gonna receive it okay maybe someone was trying to keep this from you okay there could have been a yeah somebody here could have tried to steal a house or a property from a child this this could be someone who's a, a child abuser i don't know but somebody here could have won in court this home or you're about to hear from a lawyer or a judge or something here that something was left to you okay or somebody here was being childish <clears throat> holy spirit honey. First middle or last name could start with a U. Someone's first middle or last name could start with a C, an S, a G, a Y, a P, an E, an X, an I, a B, a W, an L, a J, a K, a D, an R, an N, a B, and a U again, okay? Someone's name could be Lulu, okay? Someone's name could be Luca. Someone here could be slurring the words. Maybe someone's going to come in and communicate with you and they'll be slurring their words. Maybe this person will be under the influence of alcohol or drugs when they communicate some sort of truth to you. Someone here could own a pug, like a dog, a pug. Something here about your body. Maybe someone here could be body shaming you. We got body. Um, someone here may want to come in and bug you. Or someone here is a bugaboo. I don't know. Um, we got the jig is up. We got the jig. Get jiggy with it. Na 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 na. Na 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 na. Okay. Um. <laughs> I can't. Oh Lord, it mercy. Someone here could be from New Jersey. <laughs> Damn. Some, okay, someone here could have been calling someone a slur. A, de a derogatory slur. Someone here could be calling someone a... a the N-word. <clears throat> someone here don't like dark people or something. You don't... I don't think you know this person in real life. For some of you, not all y'all. IRL... Someone here could be puking because um, they're sick. We got puke. Maybe someone's going under chemo or something. We got puke. Or your success is causing someone physical illness. Your happiness is causing someone physical illness. Okay? Someone's name could be Gilbert. Someone's name could be Riley. Ryan. Someone's name could be Greg. Someone's deciding to do something themselves, or you need to do something yourself. DIY, or some of you could be working on some sort of DIY project. We have RN. Someone here could be an RN, a registered nurse. Someone's name could be Luke. Luke, I am your father. <laughs> I think that's how it goes. We got Luke out here, something about Star Wars. Star Wars. Someone here could be a Star Wars fan, okay? Someone's name could be CJ, DJ, PJ. I'm also getting, there could be someone here that stays in their PJs all day. No shade, I'm just saying this could be confirmation for somebody. Someone's name could be Suki, Su Suki. Suey. I don't know. Somebody knows another person is a high priestess. Someone's name is Duke. 
someone needs to take a duke. <laughs> Something about CPS is of significance. Okay, this is for some of you, not all y'all. We got pissed. Someone here is pissed or someone's about to piss you off. Uh, somebody pissed something away. Maybe somebody here could have pissed some sort of money away. Um, we have buy. Someone could have bought something they shouldn't have been buying. Okay, we got buy out here. Someone wants to buy you out. Somebody here is trying to go on the run. We got the word run out here again. There's something here about a rug. Somebody here was trying to sweep something under the rug so that you wouldn't find out, but you're going to find out anyway. Um, someone's name could be Casey. Someone here could be, um, someone here could like younger children or younger, uh, someone here could be attracted to minors. Someone's name could be Cletus. Someone here can own a deli or someone works at a deli. We got deli here. Someone wants to tell you something before they leave or something. Something about the web, something about the internet is of significance. Someone's name could be Libby. Someone here could drive a Lexus. Someone here could be celibate. Someone here was telling someone, someone was spreading lies and rumors about someone who was celibate that saying that they were, they weren't, saying that they were a, a hewer. Someone's name could be Shelby. Something about, um, there's something here about someone's penis. Okay, that is of significance, okay? Someone's name could be Dennis. Or someone needs to go to the dentist. Okay? Someone here could be eating a lot of peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. PB and J. Someone here could be a junior. Something about luggage. Someone knows they have to move on or pack up their shoes. Judgment Day is here. They have Archangel of Resurrection. There's some sort of truth and love coming your way. It says, I burn up blocks to ascension and turn the energy of negative emotions into productive actions you can take. Yeah, whoever I'm speaking to, like you, you have transmuted some sort of energy here. Someone here could have been trying to send you like the, the, I don't know, a spirit or an entity that causes people to have addiction or gets people to be addicted to shit, whatever this was. Um, you transmuted that energy. You decided to transmute it into doing something productive, doing something practical. Or there's someone here that needs to let go of an addiction here, okay? Sorry, more spirit. I'm also getting like you overcoming some sort of addiction has it is the one thing that really increased your faith in the divine okay <clears throat> it, it led you to the truth of who you are all right we have angel of hail fire and spellbinding it says i will cover you with fiery wings of protection and make you immune to any kind of evil that comes your way damn some of you might need to work with fire agate Someone here was doing something to you for several months or several years for some of you, but uh, you're protected. Somebody said, no, you ain't going to do this to my baby. <laughs> Whoever was trying to send you negative energy. No, they said no. Yeah, you're they're warding off any evil around you. Okay, you were protected. Someone here was trying to bind themselves to you. Someone didn't like that you, you left, you walked away, you took back your energy, you took back your power. We have angel of harmony and fertility. You could be someone here who's feeling complete. complete. Something here about the number 38 is very significant. Um, it says, I help you achieve balance from a, cha from a change in perspective. It says compromise and by finding common ground, topaz. 
September. Find another way. There's something here about finding a plan B or having to go down a different route. Or you're going in a new direction and this is the right direction. Okay, this is a this something here is helping you evolve. Okay. You're gonna be experiencing some sort of balance here. You're creating your own heaven on earth, whoever I'm speaking to, okay? This is what's coming towards you. Something is gonna be happening any day now. It says I show how to overcome fears through self-confidence. And following the wisdom found within your heart. Or someone needs to do a deep dive or I don't know. Something like that is going on. Okay, Gemini. I gotta end this. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what are they here? We have learned to ride the waves of life when faced with difficult times. You can either fight against the current or go with it. So ask yourself, what is it to be gained by depleting your energy and fighting against it? Don't do that to yourself. Go with the flow. What do we have here? We have find ways to fill your cup. Be self full. Follow your heart and always trust your intuition. Go deep within. Find your triggers and address them one by one. Self healing is the best healing. Only then can you offer the best version of yourself. Okay? For a lot of you, I feel like you've already <clears throat> went down this path. We have don't, pl don't place limits upon yourself. You are an infinite being with unlimited potential. You can have and be anything that you want. Don't hold yourself back or allow anyone else to. This is your life. This is your life. It's now or never. <laughs> no, but for real, this is your life, all right? It says live your truth and remain heart-centered at all times, okay? We have when a door doesn't open, don't waste your energy trying to make it open. It is closed for a reason. It says it's closed. <laughs> says you are being redirected to something far bigger and better endings are part of the cycle of life they make way for wonderful new beginnings and opportunities child listen gemini this is gonna be the end of your reading don't forget to like comment share subscribe until next time i love you okay bye